Hey everyone, it's Earth Collectors here. We are opening up 2023 Topps Ale and Ginter. This is a retail version. We have two blaster boxes here of Ale and Ginter. These are from Target. They were $24.99. And with the red card, you got free delivery. You get 5% off, so it pays for, at least in Michigan, most of my taxes. So pretty decent price point. I wish these were 20 bucks, but hey, uh, this is what they are. So you get uh, 48 cards in here. Uh, per box, uh, chance at relics, autos, you name it. Uh, nothing, I don't think, in particular special about the blaster box version, at least from what I can see on the box. Um, maybe there's something I'm missing. If there is, let me know. Um, but let's get into it, see if we can find anything um, decent out of one of these. Now, I've, I know that people in the past have said on the channel in the comments that they have pulled monster cards out of retail of Alan and Ginter, but from my experience, that is by far not the norm. That is a rarity. However, eh, we'll see how this year's is. I mean, not saying that I haven't pulled stuff out of these, but monster cards, not really, maybe relics, maybe an auto, but nothing uh, too wild. So let's get into it. And before we do that, hit that thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel. Let me know, did you find any uh, Allen and Ginter retail by you at all. I don't know that it's on the shelf at all uh, at most of the retail stores, but uh, it might be. This was, like I said, directly from. Um, there is a oh Mesa Verde National Park. I like that park. That's a pretty cool one. Uh, this is directly from Target's website. So I'm a big sucker for the national parks. They did a national park series. I think it was last year or the year before. This is the World of Wonder, but um, if you've ever been to Mesa Verde National Park, let me know in the comments below. It's pretty cool. Oh, there is a hit in here. All right, let's do it. So, like I said, you never know with this. Could be something major. Maybe this is the time for a huge hit. It looks like a relic card, but hey, maybe not. Maybe it's something else. Rodriguez. Oh, cool. Bat relic. All right. That's pretty sweet. A Alex Rodriguez bat relic way back, going way back in time when he was on the Texas Rangers. So that's pretty cool. All right. And then our other mini here is going to be Anthony Volpe. But this is, uh, what do they call these? These are um, the harder pulls. I can't remember what the name of those are, but that's a that's a decent one. Um, they have the regular rookie, then they have a a variation of a, of a rookie and i can't remember there's a nice gunner henderson so this box is actually pretty solid Let's see what the next box holds chavez that's a interesting one 338 interesting that i think is a high number and there's a right see there's the regular volpe right there and then george brett behind that and then this is the special one and i can't remember the name of those um the ones that are special but hey anyways that's pretty cool so sometimes in retail if you get a hit the boxes are really good uh and i've seen that time and time again with top so maybe this is one of those types of boxes all right i mean it's nothing crazy but it's definitely not a bad start there's a justin turner and kiteboarding there you go kiteboarding we see that on lake michigan bias here kiteboarding pretty cool Popular sport, at least somewhat popular. It's not for the faint of heart, nor is it easy to do, I'm guessing. Or would it be cheap to get into the sport? All right, there's a worth 325. I think that is a low or a high number. And here's an A and G back. And that's the A and G back. And then we have this Cal Ripken insert. All right, so let me know what you guys think of Allen and Ginter from this year. Uh, obviously, this blaster started off pretty well. I'm curious to see what's in the other one. Um, nice overalls. I like them. He is... Uh, follow, uh, da, 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 da. I'm just reading this quickly. Some of the billiard, uh, videos that get millions of views interesting all right um here we go this is arizona arizona 
only in Arizona. There you can read it for yourself. I'm not going to take time to read it. And we have the talented, this is the Hen Harrier. All right, always fun to see what is in the set. I am not all in tune to all the latest pop culture fad stars and all that. So you guys probably have a lot of information that I am not privy to. So comment below. Here's a nice Stan Musial black. That's pretty cool. And then a Lou Brock. All right. So last pack of Blaster Box number one. Blaster Box number one. Pretty solid. Um, Riley, there's Richardson. Okay, so I totally screwed up in that last video, the hobby box I did. Um, Anthony Richardson is the guy I was talking about. And it was... Um, Denard Robinson, I think. So yeah, I totally screwed that up. I had the wrong guy with the wrong name. Anyways, Anthony Richardson is the Colts QB um, that I was speaking of. All right, so a and G back, Mookie Betts, and we have a Koto, is that how you say that? Um, instrument. All right, so blaster box number two. Let's see what we can find in number two. Blaster box number one, pretty a good success overall. Like I said before, in the past, these have been bad, but Topps has been mixing it up in their retail. Um, I think they've maybe listened to their customers and said, hey, quit making garbage retail products. We're not going to buy them. Uh, and maybe they see, see them sitting on the shelf and they're like, hey, guys, we've got to step up the game. There's a nice J-Rod. I don't think the Mariners are going to make the playoffs, sadly. I would love to see them make it, but uh, there's a nice Nolan Jones black. I would love to see them make the uh, playoffs, but boy, tough sledding for them to make it, I think. Um, Ozzie Smith, the food-eating guy. I learned that from the last video. Uh, and we have a David Ortiz, a and G back, and the harp. If you play the harp, comment below. I want to know if you play anybody plays any of those instruments or have they in the past. There's a Ronald Acuna. This guy got totally dressed up for this in his red t-shirt. Um, let's see. Can be found in baseball uh, mud harvested in a secret location, the Delaware River. Interesting. The mud guy. That's pretty sweet. I want his autograph. Um, does he have an autograph? I don't know. Lindor and ooh, a gold. That's pretty cool. It's a gold Soto. I guess they're not numbered. I don't know if they've ever been numbered. I, they used to do those in retail only, I thought, but maybe not. Um, I Let me know in the comments below. Is, it, is a gold a retail only thing, or do they make those in um, in hobby, the hobby version as well? We got something in here. Do we have a, another hit? Hall, Justin Turner... And we have the talented Condor, followed by, yes, we do, I think this is an autograph here. Another one of these, Tristan Casas, nice. So that's pretty cool. And I think this is an autograph, I'm guessing. All right, let's see. Smith. Ozzy Smith. Are you kidding me? Look at that. That's incredible. Legend, Hall of Famer, one of my favorite baseball players of all time, Ozzy Smith, no way is this going out of the PC. That's incredible. All uh, right. So <laughs> maybe retail's good. Maybe uh, I'm going to buy two more of these and find out. Uh, let me know in the comments below. Should I buy two more of these and find out if this is a fluke? Um, if it is, uh, I'll take it. Um, uh, but yeah, wow. I mean, if you are skeptical of what we do on this channel, no, that's a high number, I believe. Uh, we did uh, we don't weigh our packs. We don't do this or that to make it look good. I did not make a thousand videos and get the best two boxes that I got, and I did those on the channel. No, we open up the stuff. There's a Babe Ruth, and we got a fil filigree. That's what they call called um, Marte, Starling Marte. We do a one-shot wonders on this. We make a video, we buy product, we don't go buy a million things, um, and we make the video. So this is not um, out of 10 boxes and I chose the best ones I taped or recorded. No, that's not how it goes here on this channel. We just show you 
what you can find on the shelves. And I hope a lot of other channels do that. I know some don't, they just want clicks. Um, but this is not what this channel is about. We are trying to show you what kind of value you can get out of products and share whatever knowledge we have about the products um, with you guys. All right, so that's pretty incredible. There we go, a nice black college baseball player, Olivia. Sweet. Liar, okay, do you ever play the liar? All right, so a little review here. Ozzy Smith, a recap. Ozzy Smith autograph, stinking awesome card. Tristan Casas, we have Volpe rookie mini. We have a dog barking outside my door. Another Volpe mini rookie. And then we have the Rodriguez, Alec Rodriguez. So Alec Rodriguez, two guys right there, legends in the game. One I like, one, well, uh, yeah, no, Yankee. I can't like a Yankee. Um, well, I can. Aaron Judge I do like. And then Ozzy Smith. Pretty sweet stuff, guys. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this product. Um, boy, I'm going to buy a couple more just to find out if this is just a complete fluke. Is this like one or two boxes out of 24 that are good and all the rest stink? Or uh, is this a new phase with... Allen and Ginter in the retail. Did they maybe not make a bunch of it retail and they loaded it? I don't know. Let's find out. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you in the next video. Take care and have fun collecting.